Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about properties of logarithms, and we're going to condense each expression to a single logarithm. So, if I was given this logarithm, log of 7 minus 2 log of 12. Well, <clears throat> first thing I want to do is, that 2 in front of the log of 12, I'm going to bring it to the exponent of the 12. So we have log of 7 here still, log of 7 minus log of 12 to the second power, okay? So we're going to put that, we know we can take that 2 that's on front and put it at the exponent of the 12. Now we have 7, uh, log of 7 minus log of 12 squared. That subtraction, when we condense to one big log, becomes division. So we have log of 7 was first, so 7 over the second number, which is 12 squared, okay? And from there, I say it's simplified enough. Uh, some people might say, oh, you know, square root of 12. I, I kind of like it like this, but um, because you never know, we might have to expand it back out. Anyway, our final answer here for our purposes is just log of 7 divided by 12 squared. Let's recap. We're given log of 7 minus 2 log of 12. From there, I took a 2 that's in front of the log of 12 and put it as the exponent of the 12, so we have 12 squared. Now we have subtraction separating two logs so that can be indented to be a division divided by the numbers inside of one big log. That gives us our final answer here of just log of 7 divided by 12 squared.